Boo, look at this. Welcome to Emu Creek for the very first collaboration with the Oz Cartel in the original Oz Y62 Patrol towing the one and only Oz Cartel Can Am buggy. Look at this. He's done some mods to it lately. He's gotten rid of the uh, sissy Can Am wheels, put some Neg 44 race line bead locks on there. Neg and look 44. at this. What are these? Bloody mini traps. Rock Zellers. How's the. And look, there's still paint lines on them. Haven't even been used yet. Driven two minutes on the trailer. Get keen. It's got to be an action packed weekend, lads. Get ready. Content inbound. Watch out. And we're off in the Can Am out here at May Mashup in October or Oktoberfest. Going to the uh, Flex Ramp Challenge. Not that the buggy will be entered. Oh yeah, you'll be right. Look at that thing. You'll be fine. No. No water yet. <laughs> Indeed, we can go in the water. So far, it's pretty good. Righto, so Emu Creek for us is about a bit over three hours from the Gold Coast. Nice drive, we go out the back way, so it's nicer roads rather than down the highway. Uh, it is a pretty big park, I think it's about seven, number of 4,000 acres, and uh, has lots of tracks. There's lots of tracks here. Some are a bit overgrown because they don't get used often enough. Uh, it has everything from easy tracks like this to very difficult tracks like winch type tracks. So it's got a bit of everything got a couple of campgrounds one is just back on this road we just went past and the other main camp you can see where we unloaded the can am that's the main camp uh, there's a few main there's a few camping areas down there all big flat areas now something to be noted is you've got to go through water um, to when you get in there's a little creek you go across so if you it's only like a you know not even a foot deep most of the time so it's no real issue but just so you know there is a bit of a creek you get across to get to the main camping area uh, amenities are all good and the prices are very reasonable now you can take buggies there unregistered so if you've got an unregistered off-road weapon you can actually take it there um and yeah i really like it one of my favorite little parks so we've got quite a few we've got access to quite a few from southeast queensland this one's northern new south wales down near tabulum so for us it's south rather than uh, all the others for me are north or west but uh very good little park Our owners are really cool easy to get along with nothing's a, nothing's a real drama you can have big fires there there's heaps of firewood and there's uh, heaps of uh, heaps of fun tracks to do well, let's have a look at the park
Here we are, haven't done much yet, only headed over to the uh, flex ramp part of the Oktoberfest um, little little event going on here. But we're about to go for another drive here at Emu Creek, going over to a track called Thunderbirds. We're gonna get the can in proper dirty, see some real action.
uh, squad rolling in. I see this little creek at the bottom of uh, Thunderbirds at Emu Creek here. Look at this. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Trolls on patrols. Don't mind the ranger in the corner. <laughs> and the black Old mate the taking a leak. Don't worry, private property. We're allowed to get away with that. They have problems going up a hill. Oh, up this one? Yeah, got a hill up here they have problems with, so we'll have to go have a look. Ooh. Wipe that time all up with the cannon. Maybe. What a view. Patrols on patrols. Nice little stream. How lovely. Nice little rock wall. Splendid. Absolutely splendid. A little bit gnarly. Mr. Barra. He's just come from a GU LS twin locked on <laughs> 35s to a Ranger. Let's go, Jeff. Yep, you're right. Perfect. Plus, oh, the next bit, the tree room. Oh, yeah, right, eh? Not bad, good source. Here we go, after a good hour or two at the little creek here at the end of Thunderbirds at Emu Creek, we've uh, emptied the esky, so we're doing a run back to camp. How nice is this place? Oz Patrol's just taking a leak How's in the river. I know I've said this before, folks, but I'm telling you, folks, you just can't get to places like this without a four-wheel drive. Go out there, get amongst it, grab a four-wheel drive. In fact, I've got a hat. Oh, yeah. I lost my hat. All for the sponsors, mate. Oh, yes, Matt. Oh, hang on, hang on. <laughs>
How you doing, mate? Just, what's uh, uh, what's the story with the shirt? What? What? Just, do you have a wash? Yeah, just having a quiet beer and uh, the old Christmas bill. It's awesome. <laughs> it's <a great> day. <laughs> Apparently, uh, you don't need to go too far to get dirty in this thing. <laughs> and I'm, I'm, I'm a fan. Not bad, eh? That was fun. That was yeah. fun. What's oh, going on here? <laughs> oh, how good is this? At least for me. Yep. Why are you looking at me? They're not mine. Who's on they? Yes. <laughs> oh. He just knows I'd always do a cook up. So don't you mind what you gonna do? Easy come, come. Boy. No, it's just like, yeah, it starts <laughs> rubbing this. Oh, yeah, probably. <laughs> We found the uh, limitations of the uh, of the old can and buggy. Everything ends up dirty. Have a look at this. It is just bloody filthy. After a few joy rides yesterday, but one of the seatbelts has gone bung. This seatbelt doesn't click in anymore, so we had to stop, which is annoying. Hopefully they fix in the warranty or something, or I can blow it out. Hopefully it just fixes itself. But anyway. Here we go. If you don't mind getting dirty, you'll be fine, but she's not a real clean car. So here's our dunnies. Pretty good dunnies and big showers and no limitations on time, although obviously it's water from a farm, so you gotta not use too much water, but no stupid coins or nothing to run the showers. This is just the main campground. I can't remember what they even call it. This is the main one near the, um... what's this campground called, Nate? Don't know. This is the one near the offices anyway, so when you come in, there's just a little caravan there. You go and see them at, if it's not pre-organised. And, yeah, good campgrounds. You go down over here, there's more down here. And there's the Oaks, which is my favourite one, which is over the river. I think we drive over there in one of the videos anyway, but the Oaks is right over the side, over that way. And it's really nice, down by the river and heaps of room. And this is a really busy weekend here. This, there's a big comp on, so this is a busy weekend. Normally, there's bugger all people here. Which I'm very surprised at, because it's probably my, oh, one of my top choices for a four-wheel drive park if you live in southeast Queensland. I think it's three hours from the Gold Coast, three and a half from Brisbane, because you go through Bowie. And a really nice drive. The road's a bit rough, but really nice drive. Good place. <laughs> right now, time for round two. We did clean the radiator out though. The radiator was just shocked with mud. So I had the hose on that for about bloody 20 minutes trying to get the mud out of that. So I'll do it again when I get home. Access is a bit ordinary actually. I have to work out how to access it properly or just move it to the back. We'll see. Then all the people go home. And it looks like this. Very nice. What an epic weekend that was. The Oz Cartel has made it home. Oz Patrol back in bay and the Oz K&M looking hella fine.